Farha sent us a question saying, I saw a YouTube video. In that one, a scholar said you should not look at the Kaaba while doing tawaf. Is this right? First of all, a lot of the people think that looking at the, ta at the Kaaba and the Kaaba is the cubic structure, the black cubic structure in the noble masjid of Al-Haram in Mecca. This is where every single Muslim direct their faces to wherever they are in the world when they pray. It's a symbol of unity. Also, every single deceased is buried in his grave on his right side facing the Kaaba, the direction of Kaaba. So it is our direction when we are alive and when we die. It's a symbolic gesture, form of our obedience to Allah who tells us to face wherever he wants. In the beginning, Muslims used to pray facing Jerusalem. And later on, it was shifted 180 degrees and they were ordered to face the Kaaba. We comply. No questions asked. This is a test, a form of expression of obedience to Allah Azza wa Jal, unlike Satan. He was ordered to prostrate to Adam. He refrained. Why? It's not logical. I am better than him. You created me from fire and you created Adam from clay. And fire is better than clay. I'm not going to prostrate. He is in hell for eternity. So this is what the Kaaba is. Now, Muslims know that we do, no one worships the Kaaba then why do you prostrate to it? Why do you pray to it? Well, it's not a god. It's just a structure. It can be demolished and rebuilt. It can be re-innovated like was done a couple of years ago. People can climb on top of the Kaaba. They can walk inside it. They can walk on top of it. No one does this with his god. So it is not a god that we worship, but we were ordered to pray to our God, to Allah, in its direction. That is it. In Hajj and in Umrah, we go round it seven times. And this is a pillar in Umrah and a pillar in Hajj. It's part of the Hajj. Hajj is invalid without it. Now, the sunnah and what is mandatory is when you go anticlockwise, you leave it to your left. And this is what most probably Farha misunderstood from that scholar she saw a YouTube and heard this information from. Looking at the Kaaba while doing tawaf, it's permissible. But is it sunnah? The answer is no. Is it more rewarding? The answer is no. What do you mean, Sheikh? Isn't looking at the Kaaba a form of worship? The answer is no. Whoever claims that looking at the Kaaba is a form of worship must provide the, the evidence from the Quran and the sunnah. So people say that it is equivalent to 70 pilgrimages. Baseless. People say that looking at the faces of your parents and smiling gives you so much reward. Baseless. Though people circulate it, but it doesn't mean it's authentic or true. So going around the Kaaba and Tawaf and looking at it is permissible. But it's not from the Sunnah. And it's not rewardable. What is not permissible is 
to totally face the Kaaba while going through it. So I'm obliged, it's mandatory to leave the Kaaba to my left while doing tawaf. If I don't leave it to my left and I face it, then my tawaf is invalid. Of course, I'd be weird walking sideways like a crab. But if you do this, your tawaf is invalid because you're facing the Kaaba. While you should leave the Kaaba to your left. But looking at it, there's no problem in that. And I hope this answers your question.